a month ago, I could do one pull-up. Kinda. I polled you guys, my subscribers, to ask how many pull-ups you thought I would be able to do after a month of training. The vast majority of you chose five pull-ups or more, and uh, I really appreciate your vote of confidence in my abilities and my work ethic. Personally, I thought I'd be able to get to three pull-ups, and this is what I was actually able to do. Four pull-ups, not bad. That's a 300% increase in the course of one month. This is how I did it. First thing I worked on was my hand position. You can see in the first video, I have my hands way out here. And one of my subscribers, Tjord Bjorn Johansson, sorry if I'm butchering your name, he noticed it too and left a comment recommending that I bring my hand position in a bit. Now, based on the restrictions of the equipment that I, can, that I have, I was able to bring my hands here and by doing that, I was able to get more force in through my elbows, and that certainly attributed to getting more pull-ups done over the course of the month. The second thing I did was, I hit the like button. Hitting the like button not only makes you stronger and more popular, it also allows you to get one additional pull-up in instantaneously. Don't believe me? Try it for yourself. Third thing I did was I lost some weight. It was unintentional, but I ended up losing three and a half pounds this month, which is equivalent of about these two plates here, and that's two extra plates that I don't have to pull up every time I do a pull up. Fourth thing I did, and definitely the most important for the results that I got, was I made a training schedule for myself and I stuck to it every single day. I put in the work, I got the results. Here's a bonus ninja tip if you're having trouble sticking to your workout routine. And that's give yourself a reward every time you complete a workout. I happen to like stickers, Use whatever's best for you. In the past, I would have tackled a pull-up challenge like this by doing 100 pull-ups every single day for the entire month and probably for the entire year, just like I did with push-ups. And if you haven't seen those results yet, I'll uh, put a link to it here and in the description box below. This time, I decided to work on my pull-ups with a more holistic approach by focusing on the five major compound movements of squatting, deadlifting, bench pressing, shoulder pressing, and yes, of course, pull-ups. My routine looked like this. On Monday and Thursdays, I did squats, bench press, and shoulder press. On Tuesdays and Fridays, I did deadlifts and my pull-ups. It's normally recommended to do deadlifts once a week. I decided to do it twice a week by focusing one day on heavy weights and one day on really light weights, but focusing on my form. On top of that, on Wednesday and Saturday, I added jogging and cardio into my routine. In addition to all of that, I made sure to focus on stretching and flexibility every single day. I did balance training, I did core work, and I did other accessory work. And don't worry, Jeff, I got plenty of face pulls in as well. This time around, I also intentionally added one complete day of rest into my routine, usually every Sunday. Here's a sneak peek at month two. I'm gonna be going back to some of my old tricks and I have started the from zero to five pull-ups in 22 days guaranteed workout by Athlean X. Not as a way to get to five pull-ups, but rather as a way to continue to work on my pull-up base over the course of this year long challenge. In addition to that, I'm going to be reducing the number of my workout days from four workout days to three workout days. And I'm going to be increasing my cardio from two days a week to three days a week and I'm gonna make sure I consistently get one day of rest per week. Leave a comment below, let me know about your pull-up progress so far, and right now, I'm gonna go hit the pull-up bar myself. So I'll see you guys in the next update. Bye for now. I'm gonna give some of them nice stickers down there. Okay. Yeah, they're the good ones. Yeah, what up, stickers? Hey, smiley face. <laughs> All right, seriously, you guys gotta get one of these. They're pretty awesome.